rap I have anything to do with my success? Well, I guess he sort of does. He got my dad into riding, and then my dad got me into riding. Well, I taught his father, and his father taught him, and his father was very good. His, fa his father could have been something. His father won uh, a national at Hangtown when he was a kid. But his father had to work and ride. And, and not like today, where you can, that's all you do. When I, when I raced, uh, I was super aggressive. And, and when I sat on that line, I, I'd had no nervousness whatsoever. It was just a ball. I was just gonna have a pile of fun. Uh, nothing bothers Ryan. He's pretty, pretty calm guy. He doesn't get stirred up much about anything. I, I love it, even if Ryan wasn't racing. I don't miss the races whether Ryan's in them or not. You know, I, I watch them all. I just love uh, motorcycle racing. There isn't a tougher sport in the world. Nobody picks up injuries like the motorcycle racers. But I can go to the gym and, and work out for two or three hours and, and I'm, uh, I'm, I'm a little bit wet. I can get on a motorcycle and start riding and put in 15 laps and I'm soaking wet. You know, what'd that tell you? I try to get in uh, any riding I can. It's the only exercise I get. But I intend to ride uh, just about all of the, the amateur races and the nationals if I can. And then naturally I get in the industry races and the pit bike races. Oh, any advice? Uh, he's got all, all the best qualities. Uh, like I said, I, I would like him to be uh, more aggressive. He's too much of a gentleman. It's amazing how it worked out. Nobody knew he was going to be this good. When Ryan's in shape, I don't think anybody can beat him. He's in shape and when he makes his mind up he wants to win, I don't think anybody can beat him.